the unisex bathroom law, where trans transgenders uh, can go into a woman's room, like a man, if a man feels like a woman, he'd go into the lady's room, it will make me feel violated, I don't want to have somebody that has a, how can I put it politely, a different anatomy next to me in the stall, I don't like that. They're thinking about putting urinals, urinals in the ladies room. Doesn't quite look like the ladies room anymore now, does it? <laughs> to a stall, I don't want to pass these urinals where some biological men is peeing and I see <clears throat> sausages. I don't want to see any sausages. If I want to take a look at sausages, I can just go to my local supermarket in the refrigerated case. Why is sausage there? And it's not the x-rated gun. I don't like the x-ray you come. I don't want to see that. I say what needs to be done. So everybody is satisfied. Because there was an issue with even making a, a, a room, a separate room for transgenders. Because they don't want to be singled out. There's an issue there. They didn't, they didn't like being singled out. Forget that idea. So what I would want to have done in businesses, in stores, any kind of public place, one person bathrooms where you go in lock the door and you're completely by yourself because going to the bathroom is an alone thing anyway it's a moment where you want to be completely private if you make single rooms where you can lock the door it takes the pedophiles fun away but with the way things are now with the bathroom law. A pedophile has easier access into the so-called ladies room or everybody room, whatever you want to call it. So I guess that means if one day I feel like a, a man, I could just go into the men's room. Of course, I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't want to do that. It's just insane. It violates our safety. I don't like this. We don't need any hanky-panky in our restroom. Seriously. You go in there, do your business, and come out again. You don't brush your hair, fine. You don't have to make a fun fun. But at least you don't have to worry about somebody looking at you like a guy who says he he's a woman trapped in a man's body. Safety first here, people. Single restrooms. I know it's going to be costing businesses more money in making these kind of bathrooms, but at least everybody can feel safe. There's nobody who will feel single out. And there you have it. Single person bathrooms. Love it. I'm the Reverend Elaine Yavazak, and I approve this message.